This is why making your gonads work too hard isn't always a good thing. Your body has hormones called FSH and LH. When these hormones get really high, it means your body is working extra hard to tell your gonads to do their job. One reason this happens is because your gonads aren't working as well as they should for whatever reason. So your brain needs to push them harder. For example, when my testosterone was really high in the thousands, my LH hormone was at 4.3. But when my testosterone dropped to 765, my LH jumped to 9.6. This means my body was working extra hard to maintain lower testosterone levels because for whatever reason, my gonads weren't working as well as they should have at that time very likely due to the insane amount of stress that I was experiencing during this period. Another reason these hormones can't be high is because even if your gonads are working just fine, your body might still push them extra hard because of another problem going on. For example, if you have high SHBG, which binds to testosterone and makes it inactive, your body needs to make more testosterone overall just to make sure there's enough free testosterone for it to use. So in this case, you might have high LH and high total testosterone, but average free testosterone levels. This is why I say LH and FSH should be used as a gauge to see how your body is functioning overall instead of something that you try to maximize as much as possible.